subscribe to tech me spot channel and press the bell icon and never miss another update hi guys in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to fix vlc could not open the mpga audio encoder error on vlc media player okay so we will try these you know two methods let's see if this fixes our issue or not okay so uh, you can see guys i'm trying to convert one file and you can see i'm getting this error VLC could not open the MPGA audio encoder. Okay, so let me close this. Okay, so the first method we need to reset the preferences. So for that, just open your VLC media player, go to tools, go to preferences. Okay, and interface. And here we have the reset preferences button. Just click on that. And here we have the message Are you sure you want to reset your VLC media player preferences? Just click on this OK button. Okay, so we now done. Uh, you know this first method. Let's see. Let's me try to convert the file. So let me close the VLC media player again. Open it. Okay, and here we have this. Okay, so just click on this continue. Okay, guys. So here we have the media. So let me try to convert convert save add me okay let me add another file let's see if this fixes our issue or not okay convert save convert let me set the profile Edit. Let me check it. Okay, and let me uh, select the you know destination file. Okay, so it's now set. Let me click on the save button. Okay, let me click on the start. Okay, guys. So we are not getting the error. It's now converting. Okay, so the file is now converted. So here we have our file. Okay, so let me open it. Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make your Windows 10. Okay guys, so it's now working. The first method is working for me. Okay, and suppose guys, uh, if you know the first method is not working for you. So what you can do, you can try this, you know, second method. So let me show you guys how you can do that. Let me open the VLC media player. Okay. And what you need to do, you need to go to tools, preferences, input codecs, video codecs, FF, MPEG. Okay. And you have to change the strict standard compliance to minus two. Okay. So let me go to tools, preferences, tools, preferences. Okay. Uh, input codecs, video codecs. Okay. And here you need to select this all and you need to go to uh, this you know so just find the video codex just click on it and here we have this expand just click on this and expand it and just select the you know ffmpeg okay and after that you need to find this uh, strict standard compliance okay so let me find that here we have strict standard compliance and you need to uh, give it this number minus two okay so currently we have zero so let me do that minus two and then click on this save okay and just try to convert your file so just try these two methods and let me know in the comment section whether it fixes your issue or not so that's it guys thanks for watching if you like my videos please support this channel by subscribing to it Thanks, bye-bye.